my strategy right now is to really have genuine connections with everybody because not only do you not know who's going to be in control from day to day but you can't forget the end of the game people have to vote for whether you should should win the million dollars or not you can't make enemies and besides it really does even if somebody is your enemy even if I know RC has it in for me it doesn't do me any good to ignore her or to be mean to her and it can only do it can only do me good to try to get to know her whether it's in the game or just the the bigger picture of, of life I have actually thought you know perhaps I've come at this backwards I didn't intend to be kind of middle swing vote under the radar kind of person I kind of came in here thinking I would make some strong alliances and and have some good strategy and be strong in the challenges but perhaps it's not a bad thing because there have been enough winners that come that seem to be kind of in the middle they're not in the bottom of course it appears I'm on the bottom right now but maybe today I'm kind of in the middle and they're they're not running the show and I don't know that it's a terrible place a really awful place that I'm in right now because I'm not threatening to anybody I'm not running the show nobody feels like they need to get get rid of me because of that I don't think I'm the weakest um, I think Abby Maria probably is um, if, but our tribe is strong so I think we will avoid immunity challenges and have a good a good number of people going in and if we actually make it to the merge then I'm in great shape at that point because I'm not a threat I'm not I'm not nobody's my the targets not on my back and I have good connections with people